give you guys some money yesterday. No, I don't want to. She close now. Chief, Honorable Chief Mrs. Agnes, local representing the good people of Adon local government, Benway State House of Assembly. The judgment to the glory of God. Power comes from God, position comes from God. And um, His Excellency Governor Samuel Oton won the election. And even heaven and earth will testify. God has done it. I only plead with our brother, His Excellency also, Jime, to agree with the judgment so that the Benway State will move forward. God has something for him in time to come. But this time around, let us not be going for a um, spring court to be wasting the money that he's supposed to use for the good people of Benway State. Then he should be patient and he will be accommodated by our own governor. We'll work together and move the state forward. Thank you and God bless you. Your Thank you. Um, Honorable Chief Mrs. Agnes Uloko, the yes. Honorable Member representing the people of Adol constituency in Benue State House of Assembly. Thank you. Well, for us, uh, this is a judicial affirmation and confirmation of the electoral victory of Governor Samuel Otom, and we are very, very satisfied with this judgment. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, uh, if you had followed the proceedings uh, from the tribunal, you'll see that as we contended, this is a matter that the appellant case suffered from deficiency of evidence, both in quantity and in quality. So they were unable to establish their case. And that is the waterloo of their matter. Thank you. Well, I feel happy and I feel good. Uh, this has gone to confirm uh, the decision of the people of Benue State. And we are happy and we give glory to God. Why well, they should come and join hand with the governor so that we can move the state forward? That is my advice to them. Thank you very much. We, we, we honestly did not expect anything different because the appellants called a total of 59 witnesses. Only 31 were polling unit witnesses. And out of the 31, more than half of them uh, disowned uh, their statements and disowned the results. And they were complaining in over 400 polling units. Electoral jurisprudence has said to them that you must call a witness per each polling unit. And they called only 31 who did not go anywhere. So uh, we didn't expect a different result. We commend the Court of Appeal for delivering justice as it ought to be or, or as it ought to have been delivered. That those five issues they raise that they could disagree. Yes, uh, I'm right, Honorable Taichu Suba, the Speaker of the House of Assembly. Yes, today, gentlemen, the court has done it again. The court has also given another, another point in time, the court has given hope to the ordinary man. Despite the power that might be, the court is there standing strong for an ordinary person in Nigeria. It has done it again. The court has, has upheld the, the mandate that was given to our governor, Samuel Oton. Today, the court has upheld it again. And this is hope for the ordinary person in this country. And we thank the court so much for this. The ordinary person is watching and has hope in this country. Thank you very much. What, 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 should, what should people of Benue expect? No, that, you, what are you expecting? What do you, what what, what do you, do you expect? expect that the people should expect? <laughs> the, the, the people are just standing. They stood by His Excellency. They stood by His Excellency. The court has stood by His Excellency today because it is the mandate of the people and the court has also affirmed that the mandate of the people cannot be taken away from the people. Thank you very much.